What's up everybody? My name is Charlie. I'm here with Mark O'Brien, Collections Manager for the Insect Division of the University of Michigan Museum of Zoology. How's it going? How are you doing today? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing uh, pretty good. Got some questions about insects. Okay. So you ready to go? Sure. Okay. What exactly does your job entail as Collections Manager? Oh, let's see. I've been doing this for 33 years. Mainly I'm in charge of making sure that the collections are accessible to researchers who want to use them. And that means making sure that the specimens a, are, are well taken care of, that they are able to send out loans to researchers who need them. Also making sure that the nomenclature for the specimens are up to date. So you have, you have a bunch of insane amount of insects here. Oh yeah. Many different yeah. kinds. What, what percentage of the global kind of population of insects is represented <laughs> in this collection, if you had to estimate it. I mean, species-wise? Yeah, species-wise. Uh, species-wise, oh, a very small percentage. Um, as university collections go, we're one of the largest in North America. Wow. Um, Congratulations. Oh, yeah, it's a blessing and a curse, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I know that in cert no museum has all the insect types for any place when yeah. one one group you know so because there are how many because like in the global biodiversity insects are such an enormous percentage they are they i think they estimate there's at least a million species of insects oh goodness and that's a lot of, that's a lot of yeah. bugs so why 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 insects why do you like working with insects it seems like a lot of people are either scared of insects or try and avoid them unless they're butterflies well so. yeah and that's a good question because i think a lot of people um who are on they're, they're afraid of the unfamiliar mm -hmm. and so i can see why someone would be creeped out by certain kinds of insects that are you know that or spiders for example my daughters hate spiders and I, it's an irrational thing and for a lot of people they they also associate seeing insects with uncleanliness which is wrong i mean there's lots of insects that are that like trashy places like cockroaches for example but cockroaches themselves are very fastidious about their own mm -hmm. um, grooming and all that i was a high school student when i really got into insects i had a, a high school teacher who had actually gotten a, a degree in entomology mm -hmm. and he taught a little short class and from there I went in I took a college level class I was in high school at St. Lawrence University and I went to the College of Forestry at Syracuse and got a master's degree in entomology so it's it's something I've always been interested in and they're very you know no one gets upset if you kill an insect for study or things <laughs> like that they get really upset if you kill a cute fuzzy animal oh, right? yeah. so what's what's uh, what's your favorite group of insects then uh, the group I work with a lot on my own are dragonflies, oh, yeah. and uh, we have a, the Michigan Odonata survey, which is Odonata are the are the damselflies and dragonflies, mm -hmm. and they're aquatic groups. So the larvae are aquatic, and the adults are, are aerial or terrestrial. Best part of your job. Best part of my job. Most fun thing you do. The most fun thing I do is feeling that I've uh, gotten a loan out to somebody uh, who's requested a bunch of specimens and. A year or two later, it comes back, and we have all the specimens that are all identified for us, and and uh, we have you know all is nice and neat and orderly. I like that. <laughs>